Welcome to the Course Hero Knowledge Drive. In this video, we'll quickly go over how to create an account to begin uploading documents. First, go to coursehero.com slash knowledge drive, or click the custom link one of our student leaders shared with you. Then click the orange Upload Now button and create an account. First, select a username, then enter an email address, and finally, select a password. Once you've done that, you'll be taken to your account page, where you can come to see upload statistics showing how many books have been donated on your and your group's behalf. You can also see how many days of Course Hero Premier membership you've earned for yourself by uploading 40 or more documents. All of your work will also earn you badges in recognition of your achievements, which you can share through Facebook and Twitter to get the word out about this movement. To get started adding to these numbers, click Select Documents to Upload and head to the Document Uploader. Now click the orange Select Documents button and the file window will open, allowing you to browse your hard drive. Navigate to the academic documents and select them. Here you can see that I have notes from two classes, an economics class and a sociology class. I'll select the economics notes first, and when I open them, you can see them listed on the upload page. To go back and get the other notes, I click Select More Documents and open them as well. If I selected anything by accident, I can simply click the X next to it in the document list. You can upload as many documents at once as you'd like, and they can be in any of the common academic file formats from pictures to PowerPoints. Now that you've selected them, go ahead and hit Upload Documents. A progress bar will appear on screen, and the page will inform you of how long the upload will take. Here's a good chance to remind you that you should not upload copyrighted material or material that has been authored by professors to Coursera. Basically, only upload what you have permission to contribute. Course Hero is all about gaining new insights and perspectives from other students all over the world while respecting the wishes of people who create content. It's time to tag the documents so that other students will be able to benefit from your contribution. Create the first tag by filling information about the class you created one of the documents for. Use the short version of the department name, like you'd see in a course catalog. So I enter Econ, and then the class number 101. The course title is not required, but will help other students find your content. Then enter the name of the professor who taught the class. Next, enter the term and year the class was offered. Many schools have online catalogs that can help refresh your memory about this info if it's been a long time since you took the class. Hit Save Tag to finish. You'll need to create a tag for each class that you've uploaded documents for, so now I can go back and create a tag for the sociology class as well. Again, enter the department name and class number. Here, I input the class title, Introduction to Sociology, and the professor's name, the term it was offered, and the year it was offered and I hit Save Tag to finish. These tags will be saved to your account to help speed up this process in the future. Now we need to apply the tags to the documents. Click the check mark next to each one of the documents in the left column that were created for the same class. So I select all of the economics notes. Then click the appropriate tag from the middle column, in this case the Econ 101 tag. The tag documents will then show up in the column on the right. I repeat this process for the sociology notes, only now I can hit select all on the left column and click the social 101 tag to have them all appear tagged on the right. If you accidentally apply the wrong tag, you can put the X next to the document and re-tag it. As you can see, the page will not let you publish anything until all of the documents have been tagged. Once you're done, just hit the Publish button, and you're all set. Expect an email in the next day or so informing you of how many of your documents have been accepted and how many books the Course Hero Knowledge Drive has been able to donate on your behalf and through the work of your group. Thanks for contributing to the Knowledge Drive by helping us build this powerful academic resource and helping children overseas get a chance at a better education.